<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Bobby Brown. Jamie said into the mic, adding, not the singer, the other one. <laughs> Thanks, Jamie. Uh, my whole life, there have been way too many Bobby Browns. Uh, at casting studio, <laughs> it's true. And now add Millie Bobby Brown, it's like, what? I get her uh, Google alerts all day long. I'm like, wow. Okay. Um, my whole life, there have been way too many Bobby Browns. At castings, people would say, oh my God, I love wearing your lip liner. <laughs> <laughs> so which I respond, um, if that were me, do you think I would fucking be here? <laughs> right now at this casting for like Pepsi or whatever, or whatever the fuck we're doing. Uh, a Windex commercial, tampons, whatever it is. Um, <laughs> then there's the R&B singer Bobby Brown, who I met in the 90s club scene. I'll never forget how his eyes lit up when I told him that I, na I was named after my dad. Months later, he conceived his own daughter with Whitney Houston, R.I.P., and named her... Bobby Christina Brown, R.I.P., which added to the growing list of Bobby Browns. Um, more famous than me, actually. Um, the most recent is Millie Bobby Brown, which I said. Um, so, are you nervous, Jamie asked. Yeah, a little bit. Why are you nervous? I don't know. Uh, I'm all ballsy and talky and whatever, and then when it comes right down to it, I'm kind of like, mm. great answer, Bobby. Okay, so you're all talking no action then, he teased. Yeah, I mean, totally, I'm, I'm just normal. You're normal? He raised his eyebrow. Yeah, I'm totally normal. I nodded, clearing my throat. There was a tickle in it. I needed some gum, water, a gun, anything <laughs> would be great. <laughs> you're normal. Yeah, I'm a totally normal person. I pulled out my vape pen, taking a, a strong drag. Is that weed? Asked Jamie, no. Regular smoking? Yeah. What, are you addicted to nicotine? Yes. How long have you been addicted? Um, since I was in my 20s, but I quit smoking. Ever tried Coke? <laughs> wow. Um, <laughs> pauses, we sized each other up. I wonder if this was a trap. Had he lured me into the podcast to talk about how I'd been a drug addict and focus all on the uncomfortable parts of my life story? Was he going to Barbara Walters, my ass? What was happening? <laughs> I'm a Gemini, you know, he blurted. I was relieved. Um, I preferred this direction. A lot of people don't really get along with Geminis, I said. Why would you say that? He seemed offended. Well, I mean, they're sensitive people, and they get confused a little when people say things like that, you know, like that they're, you know, have a tendency to get the wrong idea when people are talking and don't know what other people mean when they speak. I don't know. Um, we're all sensitive, Bobby, he said. I was starting to pick up on that. Um, eventually we got to the nitty gritty, the relationship stuff. It was harder than I thought, but I promised I would go down the rabbit hole.